Hello and welcome to the fresh. Oh, what was it called? <laughs> fresh Kids News Network. The Fresh Kids News Network. News for kids, made by kids. We, we're the kids. We made. I'm Willow. And I'm Bluebell. And today's story is about the NHS. The National Health Service. That's correct, Bluebell. You're very wise. Do you even know what the NHS stands for? Um, yeah. What then? National... Home... Sketch. National Home Sketch. No. Nice Art Society. No, not even close. Nose hosed socks. Because mm. your nose looks like it's been hosed. <laughs> That's a bit rude. No hurting, sorry. No. Nostrils hinged Sims. No. Sims is good game. No. no. Nurse healthy science. No, it could be though, but it's not. National Hats Centre. Centre starts with a C, not a nest. I knew that. So what is the NHS? Hmm. The NHS is the health service that everybody in the UK can use when they become poorly or injured to help them get better. It is free at the point of use, which means people can be treated for free when they are poorly. It is paid for through taxes, which is money that UK adults pay to the government. It doesn't matter if you're rich or poor, young or old, we can all get help when we are sick. So why is the NHS so important to us? Because of the coronavirus, the NHS can help us if we become ill. They're also putting themselves in danger just for us. And they do it because they want everyone to be fit and healthy. We caught up with an NHS expert and this is what they had to say. Hello, hello everybody. Social distancing. Two metres, two metres. Okay, first question. What can we do to help the NHS during coronavirus? Well, you can do lots of things. Uh, first of all, you could wash your hands. Second of all, you can social distance, two metres. Remember, I'm just, I'm just telling you. And work from home. And most importantly, follow our instructions. What should we do if we start to feel ill? Well, you should look on the NHS website, or if you can't, dial 111, which is the NHS phone number, and be like, Hey, just, uh, I'm feeling ill. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Is there anything we should be careful of? Well, yes. You shouldn't touch your eyes, nose or mouth. What about hair, shoulders, knees and toes? You're so dumb. Where's your outfit from? Well, I got it online, obviously, because the shop's are closed. And plus, I have to look professional. I mean, the NHS is pretty cool. Cooler than me? Way cooler. Oh, it's on NHS. It's on. The whole of UK has been thanking the NHS. People have been standing outside their homes and clapping for them. Every Thursday at 8pm, everyone claps at their doorsteps for the NHS. That's a little close to some of our bedtimes. What are you putting up me, bro? I stay up late. Um, I stay up so late, she goes to bed before me. Wait, I stay up uh, like 10 o'clock, up to 11. 12, 13. Uh, it doesn't one go to 13. Until, There's no 13 o'clock. one o'clock in the morning. I'm big, big, big girl, big girl. I stay up the latest of everyone. Can we um, get back to news report? Yeah. Okay. okay. Another thing that children are doing for the NHS is making rainbows and sticking them on their window. So why don't you try and make one today and stick it in your window? We're really lucky to have the NHS and all the people who work for it. Instead of our usual goodbye, the Fresh Kids News Network would like to say Thank, thank you, you NHS. NHS. Today's story is about the NHS. Stands for the National <laughs> Health Centre. <laughs> National Health Service. The National Health Service. Centre. Oh no, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Do you even know what the. <laughs> Do you even know what the. Oh, stop looking at me like that. 
So what is the NHS? Hmm? You said the NHS. <laughs>